Story time. Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to Story Time. 여러분 반갑습니다. 신나는 Story Time에 오신 여러분을 진심으로 환영합니다. This is Lily. She is my storytelling mascot. 여러분, Lily를 소개할게요. Lily는 제 storytelling의 mascot이에요. Lily, do you want to say hi to our friends? Hello, everyone. I'm really happy to meet you all. <웃음> Lily가 여러분을 만나서 정말 반갑다고 하네요. 여러분, 오늘 제가 여러분께 들려드릴 이야기는 무엇에 관한 이야기일까요? Can you guess what today's story is about? No? Okay. I will give you some clues, then you can guess. 제가 여러분께 힌트를 드릴 테니 한번 맞춰보세요. Here's a riddle for you. Okay, ask me. Who is the strongest of all? A giant rock, of course. Nobody can break a rock. No, I don't think so. Guess again. <laughs> Now, can you guess? Today's story is about a mole who wants to marry the strongest of all. 제가 오늘 여러분께 들려드릴 이야기는 세상에서 가장 힘이 센 자와 결혼하고 싶어하는 두더지의 재미있는 이야기예요. Now it's time for a story. Today, I'm going to tell you a very fun Korean folk tale. 오늘 제가 여러분께 들려드릴 이야기는 우리나라의 전래동화예요. Korean folk tales are mostly about the good and the bad. The most common theme is rewarding the good and punishing the bad. 한국의 전래 동화에는 대개 좋은 사람 그리고 나쁜 사람이 나와요. 또한 가장 흔한 주제는 좋은 사람은 복을 받고 상을 받고 나쁜 사람은 벌을 받는 것이지요. However, the Korean folk tale I'm going to tell you today is not about the good and the bad. 하지만 오늘 제가 여러분께 들려드릴 이야기는 좋은 사람과 나쁜 사람에 관한 이야기는 아니에요. It is about a mole that looks for the strongest of all. 세상에서 가장 힘센 자를 찾는 두더지의 이야기예요. Now, boys and girls, I need your listening ears for my story. Do you have listening ears? 여러분 이제 이야기 들을 준비가 되셨나요? <웃음> Very good. Now, let me begin. The strongest of all. Once upon a time, a family of moles lived under a very tall statue. One day, a young naval mole came to see them. He asked to marry their daughter. No, no, she will marry the strongest of all, said her parents. The young neighbor more went home sadly. The father mole and the mother mole thought for a while. Hmm. The sun lights the earth. The sun must be the strongest of all. I'll go meet the sun, the father mole said. The father visited the sun. and said, Great son, I have a beautiful daughter. She can only marry the strongest of all. Will you marry her? The son replied, I cannot. I'm not the strongest. The cloud covers me and blocks my light. Soon, a dark cloud moved and covered the sun. Great cloud, said the father. I have a beautiful daughter. She can only marry the strongest of all. Will you marry her? But the cloud replied, No, I can't. The wind can blow me right out of the sky. A great gust of wind hit the father. It lifted him up into the air. Stop, great wind, listen to me, cried the father. I have a beautiful daughter. She can only marry the strongest of all. Will you marry her? But the wind replied, No, I can't. The stone statue stops me. The 
father went to the stone statue. Powerful stone statue, he said. I have a beautiful daughter. She can only marry the strongest of all. Will you marry her? The stone statue replied. No, I can't. A mole digs under my feet. Actually, he is digging right now. He can make me fall down. The father came home and went to his young neighbor. Excuse me, he said. Will you please marry my daughter? She can only marry the strongest of all. That must be you. The young mole said, Yes, I will. The young mole and their daughter got married, and everyone lived happily ever after. <laughs> Did everyone enjoy the story? We saw many different strong ones today. 여러분, 오늘 우리는 여러 명의 힘센 자들을 만나봤죠? Who was stronger than the sun? That's right, the cloud. Who was stronger than the cloud? The wind was stronger than the cloud. Then, who was stronger than the wind? Yes, the statue. Then, who was stronger than the statue? The young mole. <laughs> okay, boys and girls, who do you think is the strongest of all? 여러분, 여러분은 누가 가장 힘이 세다고 생각하세요? 한번 생각해 보세요. Hope you enjoyed the story. It's time to say goodbye. 여러분, 아쉽지만 작별할 시간이네요. Do you want to say bye to our friends? I had fun today. Goodbye, everyone. See you again. 여러분, 다음 시간에 다시 만나요. Goodbye.